Today's Morning Minute. I am a child of God. Day 28 of the fraud committed by Satan against man. Merriam-Webster defines fraud as follows. Intentional perversion of truth in order to induce another to part with something of value or to surrender a legal right. Adam surrendered man's legal right as a child of God to Satan in the Garden of Eden. I am no longer a slave to fear. I am a child of God. I am no longer an orphan. I have a new father. I am a child of God. I am no longer a slave to sin. I am a child of God. I am no longer a slave to condemnation, shame, and guilt. I am a child of God. I am no longer a slave to this world. I am a child of God. I am no longer a slave to anger, bitterness, and rage. I am a child of God. I am no longer a slave to religion. I am born again with the Holy Spirit living in me. I am a child of God. I am no longer a slave to hate. I have the love of God living in me. I am a child of God. I am no longer a slave to the past. I have been set free from the bondage of the past. I am a child of God. I am no longer a slave to what others think about me. I know my Father loves me. I am a child of God. I am no longer a slave to sickness and disease. I have been healed, restored, redeemed, and made a new creation in Christ Jesus. I am a child of God. I am no longer a slave to my mind. I have put on the mind of Christ. I am a child of God. I am no longer a slave to man's thinking and reasoning. I have the wisdom of God living in me. I am a child of God. I am no longer a slave to being offended. I am accepted and loved by my Father. I am a child of God. I am no longer a slave to being right. I've been made righteous by the blood of Jesus. I am a child of God. I am no longer a slave to lack. I have the abundance and overflowing love of my Father living in me. I am a child of God. I am no longer a slave to restless nights. I have entered the rest in Christ Jesus, knowing I am a child of God. Jesus Christ legally and judicially restored you back to your legal family as a child of God in the image and likeness of God. You have all the legal rights and privileges as a son or daughter of God. You are blessed. You're designed to operate at the level of your father. You have life abundantly. You have the mind of Christ and the wisdom of God living in you. Amen and amen.